I'm Dr. Tim Kaczynski, and today's topic is immediate aesthetic tooth replacement with the Han tapered implant and Bruxer anterior solid zirconia. A 40-year-old male presented with no medical complications and desired a nice smile for his business interactions. His existing implant crown in the area of his maxillary left central incisor had suffered damage and the adjacent lateral incisor had fractured. The patient's excessive parafunction was likely a contributing factor. Endodontic evaluation had determined that the lateral incisor was untreatable. Oral hygiene procedures had left the tissue slightly inflamed prior to any surgical intervention, and the preoperative soft tissue between the central and lateral incisors were not ideal or optimal. To begin treatment, the non-restorable lateral incisor was atraumatically removed using the Golden Dental Solutions Physics Forceps. Removing the tooth in this manner maintained the facial plate of bone as well as the interceptal bone that helps support the interdental papilla. A pilot drill was utilized to create the initial osteotomy approximately 3 millimeters apical to the adjacent cemento enamel junction. A 3.5 millimeter diameter replace select drill from Nobel BioCare was used to complete the preparation of the implant site. The Han tapered implant system is compatible with widely used implant instrumentation, making it easy to transition to a new implant system. Grafting material was placed at the extraction site. Cirrusorb M material from Curasan was placed in the osteotomy site prior to implant placement. The 3.5 millimeter by 13 millimeter Han tapered implant was threaded into the osteotomy until fully seated and exhibited significant initial stability. Maximizing primary stability is crucial in implant therapy, particularly for immediate extraction and implantation. This illustrates why the Han tapered implant was the ideal selection for this case. The tapered body of the implant is suitable for tight areas and sites where aesthetics are important, and its prominent buttress thread and widened apex help establish excellent stability in all bone types. The dual lead thread pattern and self-tapping grooves of the implant allow for swift insertion and the coronal microthreads aid in the preservation of crestal bone. Radiography confirmed that the implant was placed in an optimal position. A transitional bridge was fabricated to minimize speech problems, help support the soft tissue, and maintain natural emergence profiles in the areas of tooth number 9 and 10 during the healing period. The implant site was allowed to heal for approximately four months. After the healing period, nicely formed soft tissue contours were revealed in the interdental papilla. An open tray final impression was taken with medium and heavy body vinyl polysiloxane materials. After placing open tray impression copings, the complete seating of which was verified radiographically. As shown at the lateral incisor site, the conical connection of the Han tapered implant allows for excellent seal, stability, and strength. Inclusive zirconia custom abutments were produced by the lab, maintaining ideal soft tissue contours and emergence profile. A seating jig helped keep the abutment stable while the prosthetic screws were torqued into final seating. This is critical for meeting the aesthetic desires of the patient. Note here that the dental models are shown without soft tissue material. Bruxer anterior material, which is a monolithic zirconia material specifically formulated for the smile zone, was chosen for the final restoration because of its strength and lifelike aesthetics. The all ceramic material exhibits long-term durability and natural translucency, especially in combination with zirconia hybrid abutments. The crown, which was digitally designed and milled using CAD CAM technology, exhibited a precise fit. Final digital radiography illustrated superb bone preservation at the implant site. 
And CBCT scans shows the sagittal view of the facial bone in the optimal position of the dental implant. The final restorations exhibited translucency, color, and emergence profile similar to natural dentition. The patient who possesses a high smile line was very pleased with the final outcome.